Welcome, my name is Frank Adler and I'm one of the founders and managing partner of Operational Excellence Consulting. We are a small, well-respected consulting company here in Southern California and we are partnering with other consulting companies to ensure that we are providing the best services and solutions to our clients. In this short video clip, I would like to introduce you to what operational excellence is, what organizations pursuing operational excellence can and are doing, and how we can help you and your organization. There are many definitions of operational excellence. Some call it a philosophy or a framework, others talk about a model or a checklist. While some of those definitions are taking a broader scope, Many of them are really focusing on process excellence rather than operational excellence. Our definition of operational excellence is much broader as we recognized over the years that process excellence is necessary to achieve operational excellence, but it is not sufficient. In 1995, Michael Tracy and Fred Biersema published their book the discipline of market leaders. Choose your customers, narrow your focus, dominate your market. In this book, Michael Tracy and Fred Viesema analyze companies that are seen as true market leaders or industry leaders uh, in their market or industry. And they analyze what those companies do differently compared to their lagging competitors. And one of their findings was that there are really only three distinct value propositions or disciplines an organization can choose from to compete. And those three disciplines are product leadership, customer intimacy, and operational excellence. Organizations pursuing an operational excellence strategy strive to deliver a combination of quality, price, ease of purchase, and effective service that no other organization in their market or industry can match. Tracy and Viesema also recognized that market leaders will not pursue a diffused business strategy across two or even all three of these disciplines, but that they will continuously focus on their organizational design, their processes, technology, and competencies to improve the one particular value discipline that they want to provide to their customers better than anyone else. So what are organizations pursuing an operational excellence strategy doing? Experience has shown that for an organization to achieve operational excellence, it needs to focus on the four building blocks of operational excellence and they are strategy deployment, performance management, process excellence, and high-performance work teams. For an organization to achieve operational excellence, it needs, of course, to be able to execute its day-to-day -day operation better than everybody else in their market or industry. So well-designed, efficient, and effective management value chain and support processes are necessary to achieve operational excellence. However, they are not sufficient to become an operational excellence uh, organization. Operational excellence organizations also excel in strategy deployment and they are able to very effectively align and link their business strategy to the execution. And partly they are doing that through very effective uh, performance management systems uh, where they are translating their strategic initiatives into measurable objectives and goals for the entire organization. And finally, operational excellence organizations are focusing on their workforce and they understand that engaging and empowering their workforce and developing high-performance work teams is a requirement for operational excellence. Let's have a look at those four building blocks of operational excellence. Many organizations are performing strategic planning and deployment activities. 
However, recent research shows that only 5% of the workforce understands their company strategy. And only 25% of managers have incentives linked to the strategy. 60% of the organizations don't link budgets and resource planning to their strategic plan and their initiatives. And over 86% of the executive teams spend less than one hour per month discussing strategy and uh, strategic initiatives. Organizations achieving operational excellence are mastering the strategic uh, planning and strategy deployment process. And they're using proven methods and tools like ocean planning, strategy maps, the X matrix, and catch ball to engage their organization in the strategic planning and deployment process. The second building block of operational excellence is performance management. Operational excellence organizations excel in their ability to translate their strategic objectives and initiatives into specific metrics and key performance indicators for their organization. And they're also able to use those key performance indicators to align the different parts of their organization. A proven method to do that is balanced scorecards. And I have used balanced scorecards throughout most of my professional career and strongly believe that balanced scorecards are necessary uh, to achieve operational excellence. Operational excellence organizations are process-driven organizations. And their ability to improve and optimize their operations and business processes is one of their core competencies. They are achieving this through the implementation of team-based problem-solving processes by institutionalizing business process management concepts and tools and by the deployment of Lean Six Sigma. Here in this graph you see some of the drivers and objectives uh, why operational excellence organizations are deploying Lean Six Sigma. And here you see some of the results and differences between organizations that deploy Lean Six Sigma successfully uh, and those that don't. And finally, an organization that pursues an operational excellence strategy has to find ways not only to actively engage their workforce, but also to increase the degree of empowerment. Ken Blanchard and Sheldon Bowles describe the three distinct phases that can be used to transform a traditional organization into an organization that is based on high performance work teams. In summary, we can say that an organization pursuing an operational excellence strategy needs to be able to establish a business execution system that successfully integrates all four building blocks of operational excellence. Strategy deployment through ocean planning and strategy mapping, performance management based on balanced scorecards, process excellence through the implementation of team-based problem solving, business process management and Lean Six Sigma, and finally the soft skills to establish a culture based on high performance work teams. I hope this short video clip gave you a good understanding of what operational excellence is and what organizations pursuing an operational excellence strategy are doing. And of course how we could help you and your organization in establishing or accelerating your own operational excellence initiative. As you may have seen, our website is not the typical consulting website, as one of our objectives is to provide an online resource center for everyone interested in operational excellence. So have a look and also check out our e-store where you can find some of our training material. 
If you think that we can help you to initiate your own operational excellence initiative, give us a call or send us an email and we are looking forward to discussing with you the next steps.